Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys today playing some more Clash Royale. Um, first of all, just on my mind because I just got done doing it. I've been playing Overwatch on my second channel, Molt Plays. Check it out if you want to. If not, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's get into this. So here's the thing. I'm at 4292 right now, okay? I was over 4500 this morning playing with the Valkyrie Hog deck, okay? So playing with this deck right here. Um, but I got bored. I got bored of it. So, um... <clears throat> And, and, and that happens in games. Like, I think that we can all say that that happens in games before updates come out and whatnot and metas get changed and everything. So I just have to be patient. So my goal right now is just to have fun. Like, I'm not going to try and trophy push. Like I said, I was up over 4,500. Wow. The previous season person was at 5,313. A lot of those guys, uh, and it doesn't even matter. Um, so I'm just trying to have fun right now, okay? So what we're going to do in the video today is we're just going to mess around, all right? We're just going to have a good time. So, um, right here is one deck that I've been using, uh, that's been doing okay, and then this deck, what was it, um, gosh, let me, let me, let me go through my thing real quick, look at that, three defeats in a row, draw, defeat, here's all the victories, a couple more defeats, uh, more, more victories, more defeats, blah, 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 just trying all this new stuff, I think it was this one right here that I was enjoying, so 44, look at that, 4483, um, Let's use this deck. I wish that I could just like click on it. So goblins, princess, hog, minions. Um, so uh, goblin, princess, hog, minion. So there weren't skeletons, and we need the princess in here, and <clears throat> we need. Uh, I think I had the fireball as well, right? Um, goblin, princess, hog, minions. Goblin, princess, goblin, princess, hog, minions. And then let's go check this out one more time. I know you guys are probably like, well, what in the world are you doing? Well, I'm telling you what I'm doing. So I made this deck this morning, um, and it was pretty fun to play with. And we got one elixir skeletons, mini P.E.K.K.A., and then those two, okay? So we did actually have the um, skeletons right here, and then the mini P.E.K.K.A. right here. Yeah, that's what it was. Uh, yep, that's it. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and play a battle like this, and I'm going to show you all kind of what my thought process is when it comes to making decks, building decks, whatever, whatever. Okay, so um, like I've told you all in past videos, it's important to, if you're trying to push, not to just keep changing your deck, okay? But like I said, I get kind of bored playing the exact same deck all the time. So when I'm not pushing, I'm not using the decks that I generally use. I'm like, hey, can we can we have a little bit of fun here and try and do something different? So let's see if he's uh, going to... Okay, so that, for some reason, guys, lately, I don't know why, but the poison spell, whenever I use it, doesn't work as well as it does when other people use it. I don't really get it. All right, that's unfortunate. Um, hopefully he's not going to arrow our princess here, because if he does, we're going to be in trouble. Nice, no arrows on the princess. All right, so... He's a level 12 using a hog cycle deck. Let's go ahead and drop off these minions because I feel like he's going to drop. Okay, so yeah, he's going to go over there with the... <laughs> hey, I mean, we made him waste his zap. I'm fine with that. Uh, let's go... Oh, dang it. I was going to say, let's go ahead and surround him right here. So his hog is going to do uh, some pretty good work. right? Oh, look at that. That wasn't too bad. We know he has the minions again. Uh, there's the cannon for the first time coming out. Uh, wow, he, that, that placement of that cannon was very good. You can see that my hog got absolutely destroyed. Um, and again, this guy's a level 12, so he's actually playing fairly well. Uh, but this deck is completely random. It has fireball and poison in it, which honestly isn't the best. But I didn't like the zap because I wanted to be able to kill minions with the fireball. And I didn't want arrows because I wanted to be able to do a little bit more damage, blah, blah, blah. So my thought process is always just all over the place with this. Um, but let's actually go ahead and uh, we're gonna go ahead and push this right here and see if we can get up in here. Um, there goes nice. What? Oh, come on! He did not. You know, you know that he did not mean to do that. Come on now. Go ahead and drop off your minion horde over there, buddy. Nope. All right. So no minion horde. Pekka's coming in. We're gonna go ahead and drop off another princess. He's probably gonna zap. Um, we might run into a little bit of trouble as he if he drops off minions. He's not going to. We're gonna be able to take those out fairly quickly. Wow. Those goblins just did some serious work. I'm not sure if he has cycled back through to his, um, to his, oh, there's his hog, right? Okay, look at that. I swear I just reached for the, for the mini P.E.K.K.A. and didn't get it. Nice, look at that. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so we're going to throw this down. Let's go ahead and, uh, yep, I knew that was going to come out. We'll go ahead and drop off our princess. 
Uh, and then let's go ahead and try and get a push here right now. And there they go. So our goblins versus his goblins. Now we'll go ahead and use a poison. That poison was terrible. Um, look at this, man. He's been doing, uh, he's been like dropping his, get in there, get in there to the tower, get in there to the tower. Princesses, stop it. <laughs> what are they doing? There we go. Oh, what? No, no, come on, princess, shoot him. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. All right, we gotta get up in there, guys. We've got, okay, he's just gonna zap that very easily. Um, and then here comes his, here comes his win because he's gonna drop off his hog rider. No problem. Nope, he didn't drop off the hog rider, so that was a complete waste. I got to get my hog up in here. Watch this. We're going to go ahead and do this and go, yeah, see if we can get him out of here. Yes, he didn't even get off a shot. Nice, he didn't get off a shot, guys. Now we're going to go. Right, we we got to play this fairly slow because we do still have a little bit of time. Um, I'm going to drop off a poison spell right here. Come on. Get there. Dang it. <laughs> I don't know how good that poison spell is, but we should be able to get our hog. Oh, come on. No! Princess, kill him! <laughs> kill him, princess! Dang it, man! Come on, princess! Do work! I'm not feeling this, guys. I'm not feeling this at all. This is not This is not good. We got... Yeah, we'll go ahead and poison that. Again, he's just, all he has to do is drop off his hog, and he can take us out very easily. Um, so, yeah, we're done. Nope, there's no way. There's no way. Go ahead and fireball his hog. Do a little bit of damage to it, and yeah. <laughs> Wow, we got his tower down to 461. If I dropped off my poison on I think I have my poison on it. That's why I did that. Okay, so I was a level 12. Um, all max cards, except for his lightning, which he... Did he even use his lightning? I don't think he used his lightning. So what are we going to do different here? Uh, let's throw in the zap spell. Okay, so completely different here. Um, and guys, I, here, here's, what, here's something that a lot of people have um, claimed about me, is that, like, I rage a lot. I get mad. Um, and when I'm using, like the best decks and losing with them, it's frustrating and I'm not having fun. So my whole goal is to just switch things up. I'm, I'm honestly trying not to use the same deck more than like five times unless it's just like a freaking beastly deck. Because if it's a beastly deck, then it's going to do really well. You know what I mean? Um, we'll go ahead and poison this. He's going to poison us as well. What are you going to drop off, buddy? Uh, what are you going to drop off? Nothing? Nope, he's not going to drop off anything. Let's go ahead and drop off these minions. They should be able to take out that um, that Valkyrie over there fairly easily. He's going to drop off his hog over here, and we are just going to do the surround technique and take out this musketeer. If you guys didn't know that, very easy. You just drop it right on top, and you can surround it. So pretty sure this guy's using a, um, a, uh, the, the deck right now, literally the deck right now, the, uh, Valkyrie musketeer, um, hog deck. And we need to make sure that we can defend against it, obviously. He just used his poison in that last one. I don't think he even had a cannon down. So here we go. We're going to go after this. And we're not even going. We'll go ahead and zap and, and do that. But otherwise, we're not going to worry about it because we should be able to get off two shots on that. Nope, because of those one elixir skeletons. Nice. Good job, buddy. Princess, shoot over there. There you go. Oh, princess. <laughs> oh, nice. Good job, princess. I appreciate that. Look at this. We got double barrel princesses down here doing some work. We haven't even seen his hog yet. I honestly don't even know if we're going to see his hog. He's, he hasn't been able to cycle through it, and we just took out one of his towers. Yeah, he's a level 12, but from what I've seen so far, everything that he has is maxed out. Now, here's one thing about this deck that is very dangerous, guys, and that is the fact that there is no defense. So he's going to zap right here probably. Nope, he's not going to zap. Very interesting. Um, so there's no defense. There's no defense in this deck to distract with. Um, now, that can be good or bad, obviously, but um, for me, I kind of like not having the defense because a lot of times the cannon just seems like a waste. It just seems like I'm just throwing it away, like literally throwing it away. Um, go ahead and zap right here and get over there, Hog Rider. Uh, we're going to see if we can take out this Valkyrie before she gets to us and go ahead. Come on. Oh, now he's going to zap. All right, that's all right. We'll take out the Musketeer then. Uh, nope. We literally won't take out the Musketeer. What in the world? All right, so go ahead. We're just poison all this. That's all we can really do. Do surround back here and drop this off. Go ahead, drop off this and go, yeah. And he just did a little, a uh, whole lot of work to that tower right there. Um, we also don't have the, um, the Elixir, the Elixir Collector in this deck, guys, which is huge. That's honestly very, very big that you don't have an Elixir Collector in the deck 
He's gonna go ahead and zap right there, probably. And look at that. It's gonna get out. Oh my goodness. Come on, man. Holy cow. That's why everybody's using that deck because it's so freaking strong. <laughs> like, it's, it's obnoxiously strong how, how good that deck is. I'm using that deck on my level 7, and I'm almost back up to 2300 on my level 7. Um, it didn't just coasting, and I, and I can upgrade a bunch of things, but I haven't done it yet. All right, so what do we want to do? Let's make this a little bit more fun, okay? So um, whenever somebody uses the an elixir pump, you got to be able to get rid of it, and that's what we want to do. We want to be able to get rid of this elixir pump. So we're going to go ahead. Let's get rid of the uh, mini P.E.K.K.A. right here. And do I want to have a cannon in this deck? I'm going to go ahead and say, uh, yes, I do want to have a cannon in this deck just to help out a little bit. So let's get that right there. And let's go spear gobs right here. Look how freaking weird this is. I don't care. We're having fun. <laughs> oh, man. I wish I, I want to open up those things. Look, a mini Coke Zero. I didn't get these. My girlfriend did. <laughs> I, don't, I don't buy little drinks like that. Okay. So the whole point of this video, guys, is just to say, like, if you're not pushing, try things out. If you lose, it's probably, especially if you were winning before, it's probably because you're trying a deck that isn't good. You know what I mean? But that's how the game progresses. That's how mentally you progress within the game as well. You figure out what works. You figure out what doesn't work. Obviously, that's where all the good decks came from. Someone was like, hey, I'm going to put together a Musketeer or Valkyrie. Oh, my gosh. Dang it. Dang it, guys. Crap. We didn't do it. Oh, my gosh. No. We're just going to have to let it go. We're just going to have to let it go. Let it go. Watch this. We're coming in hot. So we got our tower down pretty far. Well, guess what? We're about to get his tower down even further. Nice. And we're going to kill his barbs. And our princess is doing work. Okay, so we definitely didn't get his tower down uh, further. But now we have our cannon. So we literally started off with the... Get out of here, uh, Mini Pekka. Come over here. There you go. So, um, oh, no, 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 okay, good, good, good. <laughs> I was about to say. So we literally started off with the worst hand for what we were just facing there, the Royal Giant. We didn't have our, our defense up. Um, that is something else that I just realized. We don't have that much defense to go against to go against him. Um, so that's going to be a little bit bad for us. Oh, wow, thank you for the arrows. I appreciate that. We're going to go ahead, try and cycle through some stuff here, see what we got going. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and take her out and we got to go here with the cannon and we got to go poison And I just remembered guys that I took out the mini P.E.K.K.A um, Does he have a zap? He doesn't he has those arrows though. We'll go ahead and zap right here and look at that He's only gonna get off one shot and we're gonna get that tower back down again. We're just trying new stuff um, <laughs> We're literally just trying out new stuff right now uh, to see how we're doing so I think I'm pretty sure that he does have a cannon um, I haven't seen him use it in a little while so we have to be a little bit careful of that. And here's what I was talking about, guys. Watch this. We're just going to go in here. We're going to drop off this miner. We're going to completely stress him out by taking all that out. And nice. There goes. Look at that, guys. There goes his cannon almost down for us. So that means we can push with our hog rider right now. And then we're actually going to go and poison, too, because we know he's going to drop off his barbs as a defense. Go ahead and zap right here. And honestly, we should be able to take yes. So we're taking that tower down. Come on. There we go. And then we've got this going on for us. Looks like he may do. He's gonna. He is gonna get off some extra damage right there. But that's fine. We've got 30 seconds or so left. Go ahead and distract right here. Okay, that might have been a bad decision. That was definitely a bad. Hit my hog. Oh my gosh. Good. Woo. I made. <laughs> I made him hit my hog right. Here. Really? She's seriously targeted on the tower. Don't be dumb. Okay. Please don't be dumb. Very dumb. Oh my gosh. That's so bad. There's no way that she was targeted on the tower. Come on. And there it goes. Tower down. No problem whatsoever. Uh, we need to get something going on over here, though. I uh, Okay, like, um, um, uh, I, don't, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. But you know what we're going to do? I lied. We're going to go ahead and push right here. Drop off that miner. Go this way. And he's probably going to try and distract us right there. Uh, I'm going to zap. Oh, gosh, I should have zapped. We're leaving that alone. Drop off another... Um, uh, princess and as you can see on the right side we're doing okay nice 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 he just dropped off his cannon which was a very very bad decision for him to do we'll go ahead and drop off our cannon because we know that he's spawning everything in the middle right there and let's go ahead and have a little bit of fun here guys as we do this and as we do this and as we do this and there they go we'll go ahead and zap right here and we are definitely going to take this tower down right there that's what i'm talking about 
Yeah, he's a level 12 at 41.93, but he's using a freaking Royal Giant deck. And we took it out. Um, I'm happy that we put that cannon back in there. So he is all max troops, level 3 princess. Uh, yeah, everything max. So that's literally just like facing a level 13. Um, except for one more princess shot to the tower. So, what are we going to change now? Eh, I don't know. Um, why don't we get rid of the poison and throw in a freeze spell? And why don't we throw in a mini P.E.K.K.A. instead of the cannon? So, boom, we're going after it. We're up over 4,300 with this. Um, I was struggling for a little while getting up. Oh, my gosh. I've played Oregon Beaver like 17 times a day. Level 11 literally, literally made the account just to be like the best level 11 possible. Like, all right, I'm going to go ahead, make a level 11 real quick. I'm going to max only these cards out. Like you, from the very beginning, you have to be so precise about it. Otherwise, you're just going to end up in trouble. Um, I'm pretty sure that's the kind of deck that he's using is a Royal Giant deck. Again, I'm not too positive right there. Let's go ahead and uh, distract him real quick. And we're going to go ahead and do have a little bit of fun over here uh, like this. Yes, sir, Bob. And you know what? We're going to go ahead and freeze as well. Boom. And oh, <laughs> the timing on that freeze was glorious. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. That was so amazing. I, I really want to continue pushing here, but that's probably pretty dumb. Let's go ahead and zap right here. Get rid of all this. And oh, no, he's going to freeze us. He's going to freeze us. Please, no. Mini Pegas, get in there. <laughs> the Mini Pegas could totally take it out. Please, 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 please. Mini Pegas, go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Look at that. That is what I'm freaking talking about, baby. Yes, sir. -ry. We still don't know what his kill card is quite yet. I thought that it was the Royal Giant, but I guess that I was wrong. Um, if I were him, I would honestly probably just go ahead and give up but hey i don't see that happening anytime soon let's go ahead and get our hog rider up in here he's definitely going to drop off his barbarians nope he's going to drop off a cannon and we're going to try and distract right here just a little bit go ahead and zap oh no i missed the i missed the king tower no i didn't i got it and that could be gg guys nope he's going to freeze us right there let's go ahead and distract this knight oh i didn't surround him i put him all in front that wasn't too good um and then now we'll go ahead and do the exact same thing again with our hog rider try and get him up over there uh, okay, good. So he's going to get off two shots. One, and... Oh, there it is. Oh, wow. Good game. <laughs> it was honestly that freeze spell on top of the cannon that freaking won it for us. We're 17 minutes in. You know what? We're having fun. Let's, uh, let's do it again. What are we going to do here? I want to keep that freeze spell. So let's switch out the princess for maybe a knight. Okay, now, here's the only thing. If I face a giant balloon deck i'm dead i'm 100 percent gonna lose because uh, i mean you know what <laughs> you're gonna freeze and then drop off your spear gods and you're done um so he's laughing already people like this man people honestly if like what, what are you doing what are you crying about honestly come on uh you're being annoying uh <laughs> i faced somebody earlier i didn't all i said was good luck the entire time and he freaking spammed uh, cry face at the end. And I was like, seriously? Are you that sad of a person that that's what you have to do to make you happy? So let's go ahead, freeze this Valkyrie real quick. Um, and hopefully this... Uh, okay, so we know exactly what deck this guy's got. Um, come on, Mini Pekka, get in there. Do work. Oh my gosh, it's glorious. It's glorious. Oh, come on. Okay, so here he comes. We got to just take out this Valkyrie real quick with our Spear Gobs. Don't tell me that she's going to survive because I highly do not agree with that. And we'll go ahead and just... Uh, we're gonna we're gonna let that hog do his thing, guys, which is very dangerous. Look how strong the hog rider is. I had mine frozen up there, and he didn't do that much damage. I had a hog rider and a miner on the tower, and he didn't do that much damage. That hog alone, right there, guys, just did all of that damage. We're gonna go ahead and freeze right here and take out both of these ladies. I'm gonna go ahead and zap as well. Oh, nice, his hog. Come on, one shot, one shot, one shot. Get over there. He's going to poison. Come on, Mini Pekka. You've been ranged against me about 600 times, so I would love it if I could see you ranged against somebody else, but clearly that's not going to happen. Um, come on. Is that a joke? <laughs> oh, my goodness. That has to be a joke. Wow. Um, all right, let's just go ahead and throw this guy up here. This is not going to be a good match, guys. I can already tell you that much. 
Uh, I am going to freeze right here, and we're going to take out this tower for sure. Uh, we better take it out. Take it out. Don't be stupid. What? Literally the worst luck for me right now. Seriously. And zap right as he's about to hit, and he should go down. Nope, he didn't go down. And surround technique right there. Let's go ahead and push over here. Uh, Lady Love. And where are we going to get that freeze at? Right there. And I'm going to miss the Valkyrie because I suck. <laughs> 41 seconds. Got to go take out this tower real quick. Um, and we know exactly. We're going to go here and distract her and go ahead and go right here. And uh, then we got to go. Yeah. Distract that. Uh, what? Is my, my mini P.E.K.K.A. just took like four shots to kill a hog rider. Is that a joke? Honestly. <laughs> Like, again, this, again with the rage right here, guys. What in the world is going on? Freeze, 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 freeze. Thank you for finally freezing. And Zap, come on, baby. Come on. Yes, that's going to be it. That's what's up. That is what I'm talking about. Thank you very much. Remember when you cried at the beginning? Well, now I know why. <laughs> Big victory right there at the end, guys. 43-58 was literally just a random deck that I've never played with before. We're just throwing in random stuff. Um, the Knight and the Miner aren't really, I, I've literally never played with this deck before. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to have fun, guys, just experiment. Just experiment. Um, I got, I got a little bit ragey there for a second, but it's okay. I ended up having fun. <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video, and I'll see y'all in the next episode. As always, make sure you keep calling me Clash on, all right? Peace!